Hello, Sophie. Hi. Hello. Long time no see you. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> How was your day? Fine. Busy, but fine. Okay. I learn many stuff. <laughs> okay, good. You're working normal on a regular schedule. Yes, yes. Okay. You work Eight. for Bidri. Yes. What is Bidri? Bidri is a um, ferretería. Hardware store. Hardware? Let, let me write it in the chat. Uh, mm -hmm. Hardware store. Hardware store. Yeah. Hardware store. Hardware store. Yes. Uh -huh. And the word hardware doesn't have any connection with like software or hardware. It just makes mm -hmm. reference to, uh, 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 that's just the name to say ferretería. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. okay. Hardware store. Yes. Okay. All right. Coralia? No. You, you're supposed to connect in 20 minutes. Yes. Mm -hmm. All right, good. Mm -hmm. Okay, so what exactly do you do in the hardware store, Sophia? In hardware store, I I am a pricing analyst. Okay. But right now I learn about buy. Okay, good. Yes. Good. All right. Do you have any questions related with the class that we are teaching you? Mm, Any yes, comments? With, uh -huh. yes, with conjunctions. 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 Uh -huh. The conjunctions, it's uh, only fun boys or are more conjunctions. Okay. Uh, grammar, in English, grammar is divided in eight parts. You have verbs, nouns, adjectives, blah, 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 blah. And from those eight parts, uh, there are other topics. So you have relative conjunctions, you have the conjunctions we were practicing here, but conjunctions itself, we have the fanboys. Okay. So only fanboys, yes. Okay. The conjunctions are... Conjunctions? Conjunctions. Uh-huh. It's a... Uh, con it's... You use when uh, connect sentence exactly to connect two sentence th sentences okay uh, sometimes okay. you use the conjunction to when so the two parts agree or disagree okay so if okay. you want to say el salvador is beautiful and uh and what what can you say about el salvador and small <laughs> okay beautiful and yeah. small okay yeah. so uh or you can use something uh, to express a contradiction. El Salvador is beautiful, but dangerous. You know, it used to mm. be dangerous. Well, okay. so, yes, yeah, so it, it, each uh, conjunction has a different function. Okay. Yes. Okay. And in a platform, okay. I, I'm I doing the first homework. Okay. And when I submit, Yes, when I submit uh, immediately, uh, uh -huh. the platform uh, indicates if uh, my answer is good or bad. Okay. Okay, I have two bads, but I I can identify what is the mistake. Okay, here's the first uh, suggestion. Sometimes your answer is good, but maybe punctuation is not. So if you're writing a sentence, make sure that you use a period. If you're making a question, make sure that you use the question mark. Okay. That, that is the first suggestion. Uh, okay. But what exactly did you write? Uh, it's, a, uh, it's a comparative. Uh -huh. uh, uh, the, is the second um, question yeah the, uh, this red flower is in parenthesis parenthesis uh -huh. yeah parenthesis parenthesis beautiful okay blanks blanks the yellow one my answer is the red flower is more beautiful than the yellow one okay 
Uh, and did okay. you finish with a period? Did you include the period? Period, what is the period? Period is punto. No. Okay. In my, only, only write in the box, more okay. beautiful than. Oh, oh, okay. Only that. Okay, let me, uh, what exercise is that, uh, Stephanie? Uh, it's one, one period one. <laughs> okay, 1.1. 1 1.1. 1. 1. 1. 1. Okay. Yes. Okay, it's, only that one? Uh, two and um, three. Okay, 1.1, 1. 1, 2.1, and 3. Point, I mean. No, one. no, no. The... I don't know, in the homework, uh -huh. uh, the homework uh, contains five, uh, items. five items. Okay. Yes. And in the five items, uh, 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 have a uh, five box. In the box, I write my answer. Okay. Uh, yes, but in the second and three set, uh, and three, uh huh. Sentence? Okay. okay. Uh, it's a uh, I mean, it's a. Uh, okay. So let me verify that section uh, just to make sure because sometimes the platform might mm -hmm. have mistakes. So your answer is a hundred percent good, but for some reason the platform doesn't read your answer and it gives you the signal like, look, it's not good, but it is. So I will verify this information for you. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Thank you. Any other comments or questions, uh, Sophia? Um, no, really, no. Only, only that. Only okay. that. Uh huh. Yes, because uh, when I when when you give us a homework, uh, I. You do it. I am, yes, I do. Okay. From or or only in my book. All right. Uh, yes. Only. Okay. So no more comments or questions, Sophia? No. Okay. So it was nice having you here for at least a couple of minutes. <laughs> and I will see you tomorrow yes. at eight o'clock. See you tomorrow. All right. Good Thank night. You. Bye bye. Good night. Bye. See ya. See ya.
Hello, Coralia. Can you hear me? Yes. Oh, okay, good. So, um, how was your day today? Um, my day it was good. Okay, good. So you finished your work uh, a little bit late today. My work? Yes. Yeah. Uh, I just read your message that you were going to incorporate later. And, and where, yeah. where where do you work, Coralia? I work in Children's Village. In okay. SOS. Oh, okay. All right. Yes. Sonsonate. Yes, in Sonsonate. And you are in Sonsonate right now? Yes, I are in Sonsonate. Okay. I live here since you... I was born. <laughs> oh, okay. So you are yes. from Sonsonate. Yes, I am. I okay. am from Sonsonate. Okay, good. So what what do you do there in the village? I am um, community facilitator. facilitadora. Yeah, facilitator. facilitator. Okay, facilitator. community facilitator. Okay, good. Yes, community. good. I work with families. I work with the, the, the kids. The children's um, I visit 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 uh -huh. uh, regularly okay. in their home in their homes. Okay, so you visit the places where they live. Yes, I visit the place that they were live. Okay, good. All right, regularly. nice. All right. Yes. Okay. Do you have any questions related with the class? Any comments? Um. um in this moment, I don't have question. Okay. Just I. I think I. It's difficult for me. Uh, have a conversation with okay. someone. Okay. Okay. Yes. Because so, I. Uh huh. I want to practice the that the basic. Okay. From here, R is the the. Re, yes. The um, when when we return from vacation, that is August tenth, I think. Yes, um, August tenth. We will have a review on the first tense, which is simple present. Am, um, is, yes, are, simple. do, does, and for for everybody to reinforce those topics that are very fundamental. Yes, mm -hmm. because I don't, I don't receive class, English okay. class. Okay. Um, yes. And, and where did you learn what you know? In different places, um, but the to major, major things I learned in by myself. Okay, uh -huh. so you're an empirical learner. Yes, but for that I have that vacios, uh, I think. Loops. Loops, yes, yeah. that loops. And I want to, to, to fill that loops. Okay, good, good. Yeah, because mm -hmm. uh, I see you when you are in the class and you interact well with others. And that's the idea of the class, that when you come, you know, you interact, you ask questions and everything. So you're doing a good job. Yes, thank you. Uh -huh. Thank you. I'm glad to be here. You yeah. are a good teacher. Oh, yes. and you guys are good students too. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. So what, you. what what plans do you have for next week? Are you working? Um in this week, yes, I working, but the next week I am on vacation. I will be in vacation. On vacation. Okay. On vacation. And yes, I uh, mm -hmm. Yes, I go but I go to learn something something uh -huh. in in the national school from agrono, agronomy 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 uh -huh. yes. because my the Anna yes okay because my boyfriend works there and I will 
Is, he a, is, he, a, is he a teacher or a facilitator? Yes, he's a facilitator. Okay, good, good. Yes. Nice. Yes, that I will go. Okay, <laughs> so do you live with him? Do you live with your boyfriend? No, uh, we live in, in different place. Okay. Is he in Sonsonate? No, he's from Atikisaya. Oh, okay. Aguachapan. Yes. Aguachapan. Okay. Yes. But it's, it's from... near. Um, Sonsonate, Aguachapan, they're neighbors. Yes, but it's uh, so far. Okay. We, have, we talk uh, 40 minutes. Okay. To, to, from to one go. place to another. Yes. For that one, is the distance two. between the two places. Yes, that is the dense distance. Okay. Um, um, so we live in a touristic route, and that makes more time. Right, in right. Time. Yes. Okay. For the La Ruta de las Flores? Yeah, Ruta de las Flores. Uh, when you're talking about places like Ruta de las Flores, the name stays in Spanish, so you say Ruta de las Flores. But if uh -huh. someone asks you what's the meaning of Ruta de las Flores, you will say route of the flowers. Uh, of the flowers. Uh -huh. Okay. Yes. Uh, that is the same the, the, the national names, I think. Yeah, I, I think it was you that you were working yes. with Gladys Araceli. Araceli. Yeah, yes. so the, the name of the food, the name of the places, they usually stay in the original language. Okay. Right, okay. like Ruta de las Flores. Yeah, so imagine that you will be a tourist guide in the future who said, okay, so tomorrow we're going to visit Ruta de las Flores, and blah, blah, blah. So you say the name in Spanish. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm, I think that oh teacher i i have a question just yes, ask me in spanish i use uh, i used to suelo usar i used to i use, i usually use i usually use uh the words i feel or, or yo siento que eso uh -huh. está bien yeah uh-huh uh, but in english how how we i feel I, I feel, feel it's I, f I feel that it's your correct. idea is good because blah blah blah. So you can perfectly say I feel. I feel or sure. I think. Exactly. Exactly. Uh, mm -hmm. Oh, I see. Oh, I it's, see. I think. I feel. Uh, so they're they're like the same. I feel. I think. I think. Uh -huh. yes. My position it's from is, perspective. Right. Because I am a psychologist. Oh, okay. okay. Yes, and, and something I have a, a, a some counseling date uh -huh. with people. Okay, yes. appointments. You have appointment. counseling appointments. Okay, I have a counseling appointment, and okay. that's. It. Okay, do you remember the difference between date and appointment? um no i don't remember okay uh you and your boyfriend you have a date for this saturday okay if it's related with feelings you say date but if okay. it's related to your profession you say appointment you an appointment okay, okay let, let, let me write it in the chat uh it, it, it's okay appointment appointment yeah yeah okay. i got appointment it. right there so Thank you date versus appointment okay <laughs> so you you have different appointments uh with some clients okay Sometimes, yeah. okay good good all right coralia do yeah. you have any other questions or comments um for this moment i don't have any okay. questions so but i write the question and in another uh, or you can, minutes. or you, or you can, or you can send me a chat. Look, what, how okay. do you say this, or how do you pronounce this? And I'll, it's all right. It's okay. Very yeah. thank you. Okay, so thank I'll be so seeing much. you tomorrow. Okay, I will see you. Have a good night. Have a good night. Bye bye. Adios. See ya, Ronald. How are you, Ronald? Can hear you. Hi, teacher. 
How are you? I'm great, thanks. Okay. How's it going? I'm doing okay. You know, I enjoy speaking with you guys. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah. Tired yet? Uh, a little bit, because um, I was in San Salvador all the day, basically. I returned to my house like about 5.30 or 6 p.m. And uh, so I feel a little bit tired, honestly speaking. But but you are all uh, full time in 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 this place? No, I'm only working two hours uh, with them right now. Ah, Be okay. Before the emergency, I had like six hours with them uh, every day, but now everything has reduced. Okay. Yeah. What about you? How do you feel? Well, I, I feel fine. Uh, actually, uh, uh, I, I think that this kind of, of class online, uh, it's very, very funny. Uh -huh. And right now, I think that it's a, it's a good option to, to learn in English. This is, right. the, only, this is the, the only way to, to. Right, right. Yeah, just like you said at the first day of class, practice makes perfect, you know. Yeah. So maybe I, ha I have been. Yeah. Well, I have been learning English uh, a few a few weeks ago, but for coronavirus, uh, the academy closed. So I'm I'm I add to to this program. Uh huh. And I feel great. Good, good. Yeah, and the best thing is that it's free for you guys. You know, you don't have to pay anything. Yeah, it's a good option. Yeah, yeah. So two hours every day, you know, in, in other places, you know, I'm not going to say the names, but it's it's kind of expensive. Yeah, I, I paid uh, $40 per, per month. Okay. So it's very, it's very expensive. Yeah, okay. Let me see. Ronald. Okay, so you are in Santa Tecla right now. Yeah, I'm new here. Okay, good. And where do you work again, Ronald? Uh, I work in Atlantida Bank. Oh, okay. Yes, I remember. Yeah. What branch? In the legal department. Okay, but what branch? Do you remember uh, the meaning of the word branch? Branch is como a, a area? Not exactly. When we say branch, do you see the chat? It means sucursal. What branch? Oh, in the in the main. I I don't, I don't know how do you say the casa matriz. Yes. Okay, so you call it headquarters. 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 Okay. So when they ask you, okay, I work for the bank, and they ask you what branch, I work for the headquarters. Ah, okay. Yeah, and headquarters. headquarters is the word that you use for any business, a bank, a bakery, uh, whatever institution you say headquarters. Okay. Uh -huh. Do you have any questions or comments um, about the class, Ronald? Mm, well, I, I don't know. Uh, what... What is your 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 perception about how how kind of activities uh, can can make that practice le English uh, after class or in, in my in my free time, for example? Okay, good. Um, what areas would you like to practice? Listening, speaking, reading, Speak, writing. Speaking. It's okay, speaking. Now, if you want to speak, obviously you need um, another person. And that is, yeah. that is like the most difficult area to practice when you're free. However, uh, there, are, there are sites where you can practice listening, reading, writing. And honestly, uh, if you need to practice your speaking, you need someone else. Right now, I, I am under pressure because uh, I live with my girlfriend and, and she speaks English very well, so so this is a good option. But uh, sometimes I feel uh, a little bit 
uh, shame. Shy. Because sh shy, okay. Uh -huh. Because I know that my English is very, very bad. So I try no. to speak with her, but. Uh -huh. Yeah, but that, that is good. You know, even if you make mistakes, because everybody makes mistakes, I make mistakes, George Bush, Barack Obama, everybody makes mistakes mm -hmm. when they talk. So nobody speaks perfectly. So even if you make mistakes, you need to practice with your girlfriend, you know? And when you make mistakes, 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 one day you get the right pronunciation. That's exactly how you improve. Okay, yeah. okay. So that, that is good. Now, if you would like to practice other areas like listening, reading, I can share some links with you. You check them out and you let me know what you think. Okay, thanks. Yeah. Well, I need, I need to, to practice the speaking. Right, right. So if you say that your girlfriend is bilingual, uh, there you have it, you know, because many people the only space they have to practice the language is in class. The class. So yeah. when they when they finish the class, they go back to Spanish because they don't have anybody to practice with. Your case is different, so you should speak with your girlfriend English all the time. Okay, okay. Yeah. And uh, I have a lot of the, the, the last question. Sure, uh, sure. Is uh, about grammatical, how do you say grammatical? Yeah, grammatical. Uh, uh, um, how how is the 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 program in this in this in this class? For example, uh, the last three week, the last three days, uh, I felt that is a uh, uh, do you teach uh, with little space with grammatic? Right. Uh, you know, like um, I'm going to be very honest with you the instructions that we have is that we need to follow the book exactly the mm -hmm. way it is. So uh, if I bring extra material to the class, it has to be connected with the topic of the book. So not necessarily I need to use only the book. So I can like the images that I share with you and I put you to work in pairs. If yes. it's related with the topic, it's okay. So grammar it depends on the topic that we're seeing. If the topic has grammar, I will teach grammar that day. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So one suggestion, something that I can recommend to you, visit the book, see what it has. And if you have any questions or comments about the book, you send me a WhatsApp. And if I have the answer, I can, I can, I can okay. answer to you. Right. So, okay, appreciate. So, so all the teachers they they follow strictly the book. Okay. Yeah. So uh, you can see the index of the book and see what topics we will be seeing in the next three weeks. Okay. Right. Okay. If I want to to practice, for example, verbs, is is for my own. Yes. So uh, um, you know something that I did when I was in the states. Uh, when I first arrived, I didn't speak any English. So my goal was to learn five words every day. So I would learn five words that I would use, five words that Francisco would use. So mm -hmm. I would think about how do you say chinero, sofa, cuchara, things that I used every day. And then as you start practicing and practicing, you acquire new vocabulary. So that's okay. where that's where your own discipline comes into into action. Okay. Yeah. Thanks, teacher. All right. Anything else, uh, Ronald? Oh, no, it's enough. Okay. So thank you very much for your time. I'll be oh, seeing thanks. you tomorrow at eight o'clock. Okay. Thanks, teacher. All right. Good Have night. a good night. See you later.